Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to the regional in Elst. Today we have Eugene right here, our brand new Card Guilty member. <laughs> and he won the regional. 172 players. Eugene, what did you play today? Um, today I played the best deck, aka Sky Striker. Nice, nice. Show us the deck. Yeah, so it's obvious to play 3 Ray. And then with the, with the 3 Ray I um, always like to play Ash Blossom. It stops a lot of rogue stuff and also a lot of uh, meta stuff. It's, of uh, I think it's yeah, it's hard to play without. It's not impossible, but it's hard to play without. Then I main deck two over for uh, the mirror match, um, some random combo stuff, and yeah, it, it's a it's a good card overall. And I main deck to effect fade okay. as well. No impermanence is main. No, no, not in a main deck. Um, so yeah, obviously, yeah, I think yeah, three, three mil zero. Uh, yeah, nice. You need to. Uh, I only play two area zero. Because, Why two? Um, uh, in testing, yeah, I found that a lot of the times I refill area zero with area zero. Uh, in the moments that I really need another Sky Striker card. I really need a card to play, let's say a a anything else but Area Zero, but then I see it too much. And also with two terraforming, uh, I play four of those. So then yeah, it's easy access, but not too yeah, much access. Yeah, you don't want it too often. Fair enough. Um, then I play two Ego Booster because uh, almost everybody plays um, uh, stuff like uh, Effect Failure or Impermanence and also in the Mirror Match it's uh, insane against uh, Widow Anchor and stuff like that. Yeah, it's just great defense. Yeah. Uh, then uh, some people might hate me for it but I also play one uh, Hercules Base. Hercules Base? Yeah. What's That's this card? <laughs> So it's a, it's a draw two in some situations, and it's an insurance policy for the uh, Sky Striker mirror match. When you go through all your uh, uh, race, or no, your uh, Kagaris and uh, Shishukus, you, you want to yeah you want to prolong the game plan, and you want to just shuffle them back. Um, yeah, to be honest, in hindsight, it wasn't that great because uh, most of the time I would finish my game before I needed it. Okay. But there were some times that I'm, I was happy that I had it. Okay. Uh, I only played one shark cannon, uh, one horned drones. Of course. Uh, one afterburners. I think it's still it's still great because of its versatility. And I also play jamming wave. Yes. Because I think coming up back yeah, again. It's. Uh, the deck is like a toolbox deck and you really want to have all your tools available. So uh, no matter what you play, even if it's uh, uh, some deck, some rogue deck, you, you want that as, an, uh, as a possibility to search. Nice. Uh, that I main deck three call by the grave. Uh, of course. Because I figured it's great in the mirror in some ways and also against Salamangre. Um, stops combo, against, stops resources, yeah, stops, stops everything. It stops everything and also even against Guru Control because they uh, really rely on that uh, that, field, that uh, hand trap of theirs. That, Venus, yeah. Yeah, that thing. So that's why I play three. Uh, I main deck two Twin Twisters. Uh, also very versatile, but also in the mirror, very Mirror, important. Salomon Great. Yeah. Guru. Yeah. Well, in Salomon Great, it's a bit mad because a lot of the times they don't really set that much back row and what they set you already know what it is and also for the mirror match I mean that two shared right two shares and it's also good against Drew Draco which I faced twice this tournament okay nice um, yeah I, the one off yeah because I play all the, the, the weird things the Hercule base and stuff like that I don't have too many room to too many cards uh, yeah for the foolish space, yeah. so, only one foolish yeah that's why and then Rota and Under Ray and Upstart because yeah upstart. okay nice um, so extra deck first I extra think. deck so everybody plays three Kagari uh, three Kagari yeah they are all Ray but then with another color exactly uh, Shizuku nice uh, I only played two Hayate Okay. And one kinda. I think I could afford to do this and not uh, throw Hayate because I play Herku base. So if I really needed to have another one, then I could, yeah, make another of course. one. And then for the non Sky Striker cards, you make once a 
tournaments, the cards you make once, once a tournament. Once a tournament, yeah. Uh, this yeah. card is really good. You need it. You, you need this because, yeah, you need this uh, against floodgates. Uh, Unicorn, I uh, wasn't too happy with it, but in in theory, it could come up when you go into Phoenix to pop something and you have like another token or a monster, and then to make Unicorn to really uh, yeah out something. I think I made it once this tournament, but it wasn't really relevant. Um, then I play the Hita for yeah, Mirror Match, Salaman Grade, everyone who plays Ash. It's a really great card because you can uh, link climb without clogging your main monster space. Yeah. So you can make this and then uh, do your other engages and stuff like that and then um, yeah, use this effect. And then to go into Nigirshu to out uh, a lot of other stuff. And for the big boys, I play both Boral Sword, Dragon. And uh, Bumbler, Bumber Dragon. Yeah, Bumber. Um, never made them, but in okay. theory, I could have made them. And, yeah, yeah they're they are both great. A good pick. And the spicy side deck. Yeah. So the theory for okay, the side deck. It's time for prizes. All time, oh, it's the all theory time. for the side deck. Attention, duelists, it's time for the prizes. <laughs> Uh, the theory for the side deck was that I want to round out the cards that I uh, played two of in uh, the main. So I played two Twin Twister mains, so one in the side. Very nice. Um, also the third copy of Shared Light, third effect failure. Um, for this event, uh, I also played uh, two Impermanence. I think it outs a lot of stuff. Uh, floodgates, uh, there can only be one and some limit for mainly Salamangrate or other combo stuff. Alright, oh, number, plaatsen we acht, okay. Jonas Kosher. Round it up real quick. And uh, this, yes. and yes. this, yeah. I think these are staple. Exactly. We need to get your prices, so yeah. good job. <laughs> and uh, welcome Plaats to the team. Let's go get the prices. Yeah.